Hey everybody, welcome back in everybody. TB Sports 27, Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom. We mentioned on the last episode we were wondering if people wanted to see more of this. We got a lot of good viewership. Last couple episodes, the folks were coming in. So we're going to continue this thing on. We're still trying to do the light puzzle here in the Gerudo area. So let's get this one underway. Where's the other stuff? Oh, I hit the wrong thing. Come on now. What are we going to send up? What's going on? Welcome back. Welcome back to Tears of the Kingdom. Oh, yeah. Look at this stuff. A lot has happened since the last time we joined you guys. As you guys know, when there's... This is TV Sports, so... When there's football or things like that happening, we're watching the game, and there's there's a lot of commercials. There's a lot of commercials in sports these days. They got to make their money, I suppose. Like we got to make our money with Patreon and all that kind of good stuff. But we have the opportunity because there's so many commercials to play a lot of this game off camera, and it's a lot. We put like 75 hours into this game. So if we did all 75 hours on the channel here, I mean, my God, it would be. It would be like a 300 episode series. So that's why we're kind of just doing the main temples. We're open after we beat the game to doing some of the side missions that maybe you guys want to see. If there's like a really favorite side mission that you guys want to see us play through, let me know what that is. And we can do a couple of streams where we just do a bunch of side missions. And I still want to do that with Breath of the Wild as well. Just do a like a side missions episode here i think i'm supposed to be going to the light we got really turned around last time we played this and so this is the first time we've gone back to this in a while but yeah since we have been off camera now this is going to be a little bit of a minor spoiler about the master sword so if you guys are still playing the game if you don't want to be spoiled about the master sword maybe uh either mute this for the next two or three minutes or skim along so i'll give you guys the opportunity to avoid that, is this, oh, is this where we want to be? Well, I, I tell people to skim along. Uh, there's a light there, but uh, there's no breaky ground here. I guess I'll throw it out here real quick. Just to toss it out there, we have the Master Sword. And I'm going to tell you how we came across that, because it was by complete accident. <laughs> so if you don't want to know how to get the Master Sword, if you don't want to be spoiled, like I said, mute it or skim across. But I was just going around, getting a lot of the shrines knocked out, doing that kind of stuff. And... God, do we want to... I'm going to tell the story right when we're getting to it. Oh, here we go. So I was doing a bunch of side missions, a bunch of shrines. I don't know which direction you're supposed to push this. Bunch of, oh, probably towards, oh, I see. Very good. I was doing a bunch of side missions, a bunch of shrines, doing a lot of stuff in the depths. And I can show you guys my depths progress so far. This is where, this is all what we've done in the depths so far. It is a big area down there, obviously, but that's kind of where we are. I might do a depths episode too. That's something you guys want to see, but it was uh, right around here, I want to say, that we dropped in. There was a, an opening down to the depths, and we dropped in and did all these parts. And then I looked up, and I realized, because if you guys know or don't know, this is part of the, the spoiler territory, but this game's been out for a while. So maybe you guys know by now. But the depths match the top of the world. All right. Oh, it's already... Is it done? it's forming a triangle is that it oh no don't don't touch that <laughs> so i'm not gonna mess with those guys either so anyway the depths went down into that area looked up realized i was right above the the forest the kakariko forest so there is a like a shrine ish area it's kind of like an empty area down in the depths and I was able to ascend up, and it took me right into the forest, which I couldn't get to previously, because every time you would try to get in, the fog would kick you back out. And I did have trouble once I got into the forest. There were a bunch of areas where that same thing would happen, where the fog would just kick you out, and you couldn't do anything. I don't know. Oh, it's really hot now? I don't know where I'm supposed to go next. So that I still got to figure out because there's obviously a lot more to do in the uh, foresty area. Oh, 
this one maybe? Yeah, there we go. Just putting that in is enough heat resistance, huh? Maybe these pants. Oh yeah, those are cool. Uh... Let's go up. Why well, I'm blowing it with my three minute trying to tell the story so people don't get spoiled. I think people know by now, except for me. I di honestly didn't know anything about the Master Sword. Do I like go in the middle or? What's our mission say? I honestly don't know. Maybe this whole episode is going to be about how to find the Master Sword. Staying <laughs> back to back, unite the pillars and a light. Reveal the lightning stone to open the way. So maybe that's not it. I just assumed, like, I saw it looked like a triangle. Unite the pillars in light. Oh, God. I just hit the side of that rock. <laughs> Pick that up. Anyhow, so you go into the depths to get that done. You go into the depths. Um, it's all fogged out, so you can't see it. But somewhere around here, there's going to be an opening where you drop down. You go into the depths, you jettison up uh, using Ascend, and that is how you get into the forest. And in the forest, that is where... Why is he breathing all heavy? I got the... I got the stuff on, the heat resistance. Hot weather attack? Heat resistance? Oh, is that just hot weather attack? Oh, whatever. He's going to have to just push through. <laughs> so, once you get into the forest, you see the great Deku tree. And all the, like, all the little critters the that give you the seeds, the Koroks, they're all, like, zombified out. Kind of like the, the folks in this village. They're all zombied out. So, inside the Deku tree has been taken over by gloom hands the dreaded gloom hands which i have tried to battle a couple of times but i have yet to actually defeat in the game i have not defeated the gloom hands just yet i have no idea where i'm going but i think i'm going back to the beginning uh so that was very hard it took me several tries to get it done and i ended up just spamming the bomb arrows, like making a bunch of bomb arrows and using the Goron guy to set the hands on fire because they just grow back so quickly. They grow so quickly and it's so hard to beat them. So, yeah, this is where we, where we started. So finally did that. There's Water Blight Ganon at the end and it took me a couple of times to beat him as well. Finally got that taken care of. And we got a really cool weapon that I'm planning on saving to use for the boss coming up here. This guy, look at this. This is what we got. This uh, 72 power weapon that I'm saving so we can try to just crank through this boss that we have coming up here. And yeah, and that was pretty much it. Then the Deku tree was, re was resolved of his troubles. And then he said, hey, go get the Master Sword. <laughs> Oh, there's another, there's a light pointing this way. So it's not a triangle. I thought it was from that angle. Oh, from over there it looked like a triangle, but I guess not. So we gotta go this way. But, oh, okay, I, the glide button just didn't work. Let me try that again from the top. The, yeah, so never mind what I said about spoiler, because this story's gone right along in three minutes. But you can, you can YouTube it, you can look it up. But this was all... All of this was going on while I watched the Arizona Cardinals pull off a massive upset against the Philadelphia Eagles. You know, the Cardinals are my NFC team, and I know we lost, lost draft positioning, but I could not have been more excited watching that game when that went down. It was like, man, that was the highlight of the season for me. For the Arizona Cardinals, seeing them go into Philly and beat a team that might represent the NFC in the Super Bowl again. So, that was pretty pretty exciting stuff. Yeah, this is really annoying. Really hard to see. So, once you cure the great Deku tree of all his gloomy goodness, gloom hands inside. And am I completely lost where I was going? I think I have. <laughs> oh, wait. No, there's the light. 
Follow the light, or is that... No, that's... There was one beam of light that was going this way. God, now I gotta eat. I don't have any resistant, heat resistant anything. Do I have any food? Here, this, here we go. It's all heat resistant. I don't wanna waste that. I got a minute. Once you uh, clear the great Deku tree, he'll tell you that he'll, you get a cutscene that you see, and uh, Zelda will appear and tell you that she took the Master Sword, she rebuilt it, and she put it on the head of a dragon. I'm not helping you. I got another mission to take care of. She put it on the head of a dragon, and the Deku tree puts it on your map and says, hey, go find this guy, take the sword out of his skull. Um, oh, it's pointed, like, over here. Luckily for me, that wasn't an issue because I just went up into the sky and I was able to drop down onto the dragon's head. Again, I'm doing all this during commercials while the Cardinals are trying to pull off a massive upset on the Philadelphia Eagles. Uh, because I started listening to Aaron from Game Grumps, who, you know, originally in, in Breath of the Wild and then now in this game, I was all, I was all in on getting the hearts, get the hearts, I started watching the Game Grumps playthrough, and Aaron was really big on just get the stamina, right? Like, you can always eat. You can always eat food. You can always recover. But I feel like I'm getting all turned around here. You can always eat food. You can always recover. But getting stamina is going to make the game so much easier. So the last couple of times I've gotten four stamina wheels, I have pretty much done just that. I've been just getting the... Uh, just getting stamina. And that helped in this case because I needed pretty much all the stamina to pull the sword out of the dragon's head. And I got the master sword. So that's how you do it. So drop into the depths. Ascend up into the great forest. And defeat the hands, the gloom hands. Help out the Deku tree. He'll let you know where the dragon is. You can drop from the sky onto the dragon's head. And I think this is where I freaking started. You can drop from the sky onto the dragon's head. Make sure you have enough stamina. Pull the sword out. Wham, boom. And you got the master sword. Uh, another little brief um, tidbit that I want to hear from you guys is, as I was mentioning before, how in the heck... I think I'm supposed to go that way, right? Because that's all connected. The last beam of light. So let's go back here and see if we can't make it that way. But I want to know, how do you... I, I did a couple of the paths in the forest. I did a couple of the areas where the fog was. And there's like a mission where you have to go through the fog and stuff. But then there's a big parts of that map that you really can't even explore because the fog just kicks you back. How do you get through it? I, I remember that from the last game, but I don't remember what I did. So if you guys know, let me know. Let me know in the comments. This fog is really a pain in the freaking neck to do this. <laughs> oh my god, we can't... Oh, I was going to say, come on. While we're ascending, we want to let you know we are TV Sports 27 Follow along with us. Twitch, YouTube, all those places. Patreon. Um, we might do a little extra Patreon stream at the end of this. Probably go for about... I don't know, two hours or so today. And then if we defeat the end boss, what we are going to do is we'll do a little explore the city for like 30 minutes. But we got to help hope that we beat the boss. If not, we'll save it for another time. But thank you guys always for helping to support the channel, TV Sports 27. That is us. But we are continuing on trying to figure out where this last light goes. And I'm not... I've already lost it. It was back here, wasn't it? That seems like a really far way back. Is it that thing? No. Because that's over here. Unless that... I've, I've lost the light. There's... One light. This sucks. <laughs> Going back. Seeing if we can figure out this path. 
Oh, man. Should I have done this part off camera? <laughs> or do you guys like seeing this? Oh, God. Right into a terrible spot. Just, just get away. And it's all, like, so hot out here. Like, when I started this thing, it was cold. I had to put cold clothes on, and then now it's just like, oh, all of a sudden, it's going to be hot. Like, how'd that happen? Okay. Let's go back up. Let's try to retrace our steps. Maybe, do I need to go back to that other? Well, I guess the thing that confused me is that... That light connected to there. There, there. And then... Yeah, the last light is, like, that way. And I ended up over there and then lost the light. Okay, well, let's try it. Just keep, just keep rocking straight. The problem is, it, it fades away so quick. It kind of ends, like, here. Like, this is where the light ends. The light is done here, but there's nothing... What's up here? Is this anything? No, you. Oh, we got this. Let's see what's in here. Really? I just wait. Oh, it's a baddie. <laughs> that was my. That was the first thing I've used a master sword on. So there you go. Yeah, see the lights again. I need to go up more. I guess there's more light this way, so let's keep rolling this way. Keep pushing forward. And then you lose it. What is, is that all the way up there? No. And then the light's gone. Uh, maybe up here? Is this where I need to be? Let's try up here. If I don't... what? Where are we at? We're 17 minutes in. I'm going to go to the 30 minute mark. Oh, well, this is right back at the Gerudo area. So I'm right back to where I, I follow the path again. If I don't figure this out here in the next 10 minutes, I will figure it out off camera and on the next episode... I'll have it ready to go. So that's, that's what I climbed up on, and then I lost the light. I don't know where that light... Is it that tower that's pointing the wrong way? Because does that need to go to there, maybe? Maybe that's what threw me off, as I saw... Maybe that's how you close it, because I've been to two areas, but when I saw them all get connected and that light shining that way, I thought, follow the light to that one, but maybe that's the path. Okay, so let's, let's go this way, because I don't believe we have been here yet, and maybe we got to spin that, and maybe we close it into a box. Maybe there's not a fourth thing over there. We've been to two areas. So can this one move? That would be the question. And you shine that one back on the first one. Did they say something about there being three or four pillars? I don't know if I remember. But hopefully that'll be the, uh, the big uh, grand conclusion. Yeah. So plans for non-sports streaming is going to be play this here. What is this? Shrine. Have we done that one yet? Play this. If we continue to get good viewership, we'll do the Ganondorf battle at the end of the game. It's either going to be, because I imagine there's going to be a long like end game to it. So if we get a lot of viewership, if we get a lot of, a lot of requests for it, we'll do the whole thing. If Oh, now it's cold again. If uh, we don't really get any viewership, um, which 
it's kind of half and half. We get really good viewership or we get really terrible viewership. There's not really an, <laughs> an in-between, so it's kind of funny. So, depending on when these next couple episodes go out, we'll either just do the Ganon fight or we'll do the entire end of the game, whichever you guys want to see. Yeah, I haven't been here yet. Okay. Do I want to do I want to do this part real quick? I might as well, right? Just so I have somewhere to come back to. Yeah, let's do it. Come on. And then we can we can easily get back. So that'll be the plan there, and then we will go back to playing Mario Wonder once we get done with this, finish up that, and then it'll pretty much be oh oh hold on, hold on. hello I didn't realize I was in quicksand. After that, it'll pretty much be. Uh, maybe, I guess, God of War and Horizons, we'll go back to that, and then the Pokemon card game, if you guys want to see that on G GBA, and then, as promised, Oracles and Ages and Seasons, which we have never played before. Okay. So this is a little different. Oh, this is... Okay, we don't have to do anything here. An easy, an easy one. What's the? What was the mission, then? Normally, these ones, you have to do a little game before you get here. I don't care about that. Well, I like that. Cool. Thanks, Raru. That was well, 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 well worth it. Now we have that path in the desert closed off. I think we're getting pretty close to getting another upgrade. Yeah, we got one more. When we were in the forest area, there was a place where you could put your prayers in and you can get more um more items and that's where i got a bunch of more stamina so so now the problem is going to be figuring out how to get back it was that fire right i'm wondering was the quicksand like the game that you had to do or something i don't know Maybe it was. Maybe that's why. Okay. Maybe that's what the, the big mission was. And I just kind of skipped right past it. Look at this guy. He can't even see me. Maybe I just uh, I skipped right past it because... Oh, yeah. I think that's exactly what happened. The mission was the quicksand. So that, that was supposed to be the game that made it the easy... The blessing, but because I came from the tower, I just skipped right on through it. Alright, let's see if we can knock this out in this last episode here. If we can get this taken care of, we can go into a new episode here, fresh, getting ready to take on the, the temple, the dungeons. So I'm going to take your guys' milk. I'm not worried about you guys here. Take some fire. Oh, come on, Link. There we go. No, oh, come on. Yes, there we go. Oh, really? He's got no get up and go? There we are. Holy smokes. There we go. All right, what do we do with this thing here? There's a wheel up top. What's down here? Oh, there's all kinds of stuff down here. Something. Oh, maybe that's how you get up there? Is there something under here that we need? Oh, get off these logs. Are you kidding me? Anything under this rock? Any, any hidden? Oh, we're about to get, we're about to get blood mooned here. About to be a new. There we go. Rise. They're all gonna rise. So. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you, Zelda. Thank you, Zelda, for another challenge. <laughs> okay. Thing under here or is it just yeah there's nothing there's something all right 
We can just ascend up, can't we? Oh. Yeah, I can ascend up. And then there's a wheel spin situation. Oh, I think I get the game. There are no cogs of which to spin the wheels. So we need that wood. So I think you attach the wood to those guys. Those guys float in the air. You ascend up and you take them, I think. Do we need all four of these? Because realistically, we just need one, right? Let's see what happens. Let's try to just do one. Oh, am I going to be able to reach that? Well, this will be interesting. Maybe that's why you need the second one. Oh, yeah, I think I definitely need the second one. Oh, can we get it? We got plenty of battery life. Yes. Oh, really? Oh, come on. Are you kidding me right now? They just get stuck to each other. Jeez Louise. <laughs> Is this the right or wrong way to be doing this? Why can't I get up there? If I do all this and it turns out I need all, I need all four, then I'm really going to be antsy here. I've been watching the Game Grumps playthrough of this as well. I guess I need this to be over my head. And I do now realize there are opportunities to increase uh, your battery life somewhere down in the depths. So, this sucks. Is this the right way to be doing this? I'm about to run out of battery life. So at some point, I need to do that, but I honestly have not even stumbled across those guys in the, in the depths yet, so... I haven't even gotten the camera. I keep getting a lot of people, too, in the in different cutscenes where they're like, go get the camera. Jeez, oh, are you kidding me? Can I put that over there? And I haven't even gotten to the camera yet, so that's something I'll, I might do off camera. Well, I'm about to just lose everything, so just let everything power back up. But I need to get the camera at some point. Uh, I do know there is a an auto build because I saw that part of Game Grumps, the auto builder. Do I just have my own items I can do this with instead of whatever this game is? Hot air balloon or anything? I have my own light. <laughs> I can put my own. Can I put my own mirror up there and just shine it? Um, I don't really have anything. Oh, there, yeah, hot air balloon. And this. So. Yeah, let's do that. Put you on you. So that's what those last two wheels are, mind you, is the... Is the auto build and the camera, which I have not yet found. The ca the auto build, I don't know how you would find that without just like looking it up or knowing. Because I I watched the game grumps do it, and Aaron had some knowledge ahead of time of how to do it. But my God, that was like you had to go to a very specific spot in the massive depths. You had to do all these very specific things. That's kind of wild. So. Um, at some point, I'll be doing that. I've done a couple of the Great Fairy stuff, though. I happened to just stumble across that, the Great Fairy. And then I was able to find the violinist or what have you. And I did that. And then I was working on the flutist before I came back here to this particular episode in time. So this will be interesting because I don't know how quickly can I get these now that I'm thinking about it quickly I can get these. There's one. 
Okay, and the second one didn't come, but maybe you only need one. Maybe that's all you need. You only you only need one to push it good enough, right? Yeah, see? But now what's it doing? Oh, okay, yeah, there we go. This is it. This is it. Did it hit? Oh, yep. Oh, it is a triangle. Okay, so you just had to close it off. Look at that. right now cool oh I, this is the second time I've done that do I still have the triangle all right what do they want me to do next uh, you saw the shrine based on the light huge triangle perhaps at the center right where'd the light go oh right here okay I got all turned around. Well, I think that's a good stopping point for right now. We're going to keep this party rolling. If you're watching us live on Twitch or on Patreon, we probably got another hour and a half or so with you guys. If you're watching on YouTube, we got more episodes coming back. So join us tomorrow. We're going to head for the shrine in the middle of the map and see if we can't get the fourth dungeon temple knocked out here in this game. Catch you guys tomorrow.